Good morning. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I hope you guys are all doing good because I'm doing great. I slept for nine hours last night. I'm very energized. But today I wanted to do a come with me on my white coat ceremony day. So let me catch all up to speed. Back in February, I got accepted into pharmacy school. And back in May, just a couple months ago, I graduated from my university with my bachelor's of science in psychology. Then from there, I started pharmacy school um, two weeks ago. And today is my white coat ceremony, so I will be getting that around 11, 11 a.m. 11 a.m. But right now, I'm about to leave to get my makeup done. I was gonna do my own, but then I was like, mm, I don't feel like it. So I found this girl who does makeup so good on my campus, and she will be doing it, and I will be heading out there now. <laughs> okay, so makeup is done, and my parents are not pulling in yet, but they are here, so I am about to head out. Um, I don't think I need anything. I'm heading out now. I'm gonna take my tripod with me so we can take pictures on campus or we gotta come back here. Please proceed with your coding. Thank you. Thank you. Bioshock Pro. Yep. I had to think of that. Wow. Look at our sea of white coats. And about who coach you. It's about the symbolism of the coat, as you heard earlier today. And I want you all to settle in um, and enjoy the rest of today's ceremony. You represent 11 states, with nearly 100 of you coming from Minnesota, and also a dozen from across the border in Wisconsin. Students also join us from states across the country, from California to New Hampshire, and everywhere in between. 21, 21 of you were born in other countries, including Ghana, Thailand, Ukraine, and China, just to name a few. You have majored in nearly 30 disciplines. A number of you have majored in the sciences, such as biochemistry, biology, chemistry, and microbiology. But many of you have majored in other fields, such as French, creative writing, engineering, and communications. Classmates, please stand and listen along as we write the pledge out loud. We'll ask you to join in the closing statement, which can be found on the screen. It's one, one that demands adherence to the set of rigid set ethical, ethical standards. These high ideals are necessary to ensure the quality of care extended to the patients I serve. As a student of a pharmacy, I believe this does not start with graduation. Rather, it begins with my membership in this professional college community. Therefore, I must strive to uphold these standards as I advance toward the goal of membership in the professional pharmacy. So as you can see, I am officially coded. My goodness, my parents literally were jumping on the screen. They turned the camera on and my mom was like, did they not want to see you? I'm officially coded, which is amazing. And now we're going to take a good picture. Oh, that's just gorgeous. One, two, three. Hold on, I'm going to take you back. 
couple. One, two, 